Okay, well let, let's let's head towards it because there's actually quite a lot of stuff on the way towards it. So if we continue forward from here, we'll reach a camp. And it looks like quite a big camp. So who knows? It, like here it is actually. Here's the camp. We we might have to start heading back though because it's going to get dark eventually. That's my concern, you see. We're on the opposite side of the island. And if we get stuck in the darkness... Oh, okay. Well, there is rope that we can get here, so... As you can see... It knocks them down. So... It might not do necessarily tons more damage... But it knocks them over easier, which is really good, right? Are they fighting each other? No, they're not. Okay, we got one. Oh, frick. My arm is nearly gone now, which is a bit worrying. Okay, it's gone now. Is he alive? He's alive. Okay, well, I took some damage from them, unfortunately. And there's another one coming across now, so... Damn it, I unblocked just as he hit me. Okay, well, we found some meds in that cave, so there we go. We used some meds. We took out a lot of these guys, so I'm not too upset about taking damage. Just found a snack as well. So we're finding some stuff around here. I think there's some rope. Here we go. There's some rope up here. So that's that's good. I'm glad we found some rope. The sun is slowly going down. Okay, now if we continue in this direction. And we head left. We should find some... I don't think I'm going to get the katana right now, guys, actually thinking about it. But we'll head back in this direction because it's a different route. But apparently if you head around here, I, I mean, I'm looking at the map, there should be some parts of the plain. We have to be careful that no one's sneaking up on us as well. So if you head around here, apparently there's parts of the plane in the woods beside us to our right over there, I think. I don't want to look at the map too much because we haven't got long. The sun is starting to go down. I'm heading back. I know you guys want me to continue. But there's, and I, I know I've got the torch now, but there's no way I really want to be out at night. I'm sorry. Are we back at the lake? Or is this a different lake? Yeah, we're back at that lake. Okay, is that a feather? So yeah, this axe isn't too bad. It's got good blocking apparently. It's a bit slower though. That's one concern that I have with it. I'm thinking maybe we collect some feathers. And add some feathers to it to make it... F I can hear something. I thought I could hear a cannibal running. Uh 
That's what we need. Yeah, like, I'm going to, like, I don't want to miss uh, lizards, but sometimes when you're in a rush, you, you're just not focusing on finding them, you know? I've already got a turtle shell. I should have used it because we found so many turtles on the way. Um, but yeah, what I think we will do... We'll get full armor again because I think it's very useful to have it. Very useful. We need more leaves as well because... Yeah, this axe is really slow, isn't it? I read that it's a really good axe to have. I guess because it does a lot of block. Aha. And I think it does a bit more damage as well. I love how it's called a modern axe. The plain axe looks more modern. Just saying. Do I see a lizard here? No, it's just leaves. Okay. So I'm I'm happy that we've done something other than building. We did a bit of We did a bit of uh scouting, so we've seen a little bit uh more of the island. And we also obtained a new item. So I think today was a pretty good day. Um what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spend the next day trying to get full armor again. Maybe even if I don't get stealth armor, maybe if I just get regular armor. And also trying to complete this wall. Just because I think that we should kind of try and mix it up a little bit. So we do a bit of hunting and a bit of building. Oh yeah, that's why I got this axe, wasn't it? It's because it chops down trees quicker. That's, that's the main purpose for me getting this axe. Okay, it's getting too dark. Frick that. I ain't going out there in the dark. I do like this torch though. So we got a torch as well. Right, let's head up. We got lots of rocks here too. So I'm thinking we got a lot of sticks and rocks so we can eventually build some cool stuff. Okay, so let's just save. Always have a look. What's that noise? I'm just going to put that on for a second because I know animals make noises, but it didn't sound like an animal. I'm sorry, it didn't. Sounded like a freaking mob or something down there. Okay, so let's catch a fish. Hmm. I thought I could hear a mob then. Okay, where are you, fish? I'm pretty sure ponds don't run out of fish. I'm pretty sure. If they do, then that'll suck because. So this is the, like this is the goal is to complete that wall and just have like a really nice um, platform up there with uh, molot loads of. We got dynamite now as well. It can be used to blow things up. So we have like our weapon rack. We've also got a compass here. Money which we can use for. Um, Money which can be used on the fire to get the fire going. What else do we have? We've got rope. We've got the turtle shell. So I'm thinking we make another rain thing here. We might as well because... Water collector. 
Okay. There we go. Get rid of the turtle shell. So if we come across another turtle. I don't think there's anything else you can use turtle shells for. Do you know what would be cool though? If you could make armor out of them or a shield. You can make a shield out of them. Is there anything else we can make? We've got a lot of skulls which we could probably use. We've got deer skin. Because if you have too much of stuff, you kind of want to use it a little bit. Because you can't collect any more, if that makes sense. So... We've got some rocks. We should probably drop these rocks off in our little... ...thing here, actually. Because we're always passing rocks, and... ...we're always full. Okay, let's chop our first tree down. With this new axe. I'm probably f more excited than I should be. I'm pretty excited. <laughs> because w we accomplished something by getting this axe, you know? Okay, this should be fine. Four, five, six, eight, nine... That's much quicker. That was quicker, guys. That was quicker. Stop shaking your heads. No, it, it is actually quicker. It is. Okay, don't mock me. I can see you mocking me. I'm chuffed with that. I'm really chuffed. Nine. Takes nine, whereas normally it would take like 15 or some shiz. Oh, that's a crap. Oh well. I guess sticks is better than nothing. Okay, I'm not going to worry about the stealth thing, because we don't have many leaves. I know I've got 12, but I'd rather just have a little bit of arm. I, I don't... Oh, crap. We never ate our fish. That's not good. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab these two logs and just leg it over there and just eat that fish. I forgot to eat the fish. Look at my hunger. It's nearly it's nearly all gone. There's never anything in that trap. It's freaking useless. It's because the deer keep running past it. Oh, wow. That, like, did none of my hunger. I think it's because uh, I ate it like, I left it so long to eat it. Let's get another one. Okay, we got two just in case. It's because I'm so... I, I want to just build, you know? Okay, let's put that down. Put that down. Get our good axe out. Our epic I'm gonna call it the epic axe get our fish cook it get our other fish and hang it collect these rocks pop them in there pop the sticks that we got oh have we got a full stick thing we got a log here as well which we can quickly use Okay, I I'm running away from the fish again. You guys are going to freaking kill me. Oh, it's ready already. Okay, that gave us full hunger. I'm happy. We got some logs down here as well. Okay. Let's grab these. We can probably get rid of a couple of these trees too. Although these trees look quite thin. Is that a stick tree? That looks like a log tree, I think. I think... I think that's a log tree. I'd love like a basket that you could put down there or a, a little elevator which you could chop logs and stuff and get them to come up. Okay, so if we chop this down. I love this axe though. It's so much quicker and it uses a lot less stamina. Look at my stamina going up. It's like nearly full and I'm constantly chopping. 
This one's taking longer because I think I wasn't moving where I was aiming the axe. Okay. Where's the other log? There it is. Get it. Get this rock. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing good, guys. Let's get this tree. Let's try and get it to fall in that direction. Hopefully... Okay, we managed to get it. Oh, we don't want that falling off. We don't want the log to lose the logs. I was going to say, hopefully I can get back up off the edge. Because I was right on the edge. But man, those logs were like ferocious right there. Yeah, I wonder if we can chop these down. Whoa, what the frick? So you can. You can get rid of the... I think if you get rid of them, they don't regrow. Weird. It, like, turned into a bigger... A bigger one. Well, we need 30. So I'm just chopping down the ones nearest it just so I can run and put these ones down. And then, because uh, it's good to do a little bit of exercise, you know what I mean. Uh, but we're nearly, we've nearly done this. I'm surprised it's going to take 30 just for this wall. It's not that big. Like, we've nearly completed the wall. When we start doing the platforms, though, that's when it's going to... In fact, we are going to need, like, a way in with the logs um, to complete the platform because I don't think we can lift logs up the rope. If you know what I mean. So we are going to need a doorway into the base. That we will need a doorway. Because I don't think you can carry logs up, uh, up that rope. Unless there's something, some other way we can do it. Like if there's a way to get the logs in to the base without having a door. That would be quite cool because I don't want a doorway because then the mobs, like the spider things, will just walk through the door. I, w I want my base to be a safe, a safe zone, you know, where when you're in it, you feel really safe. Not, oh, it's really safe, but there's a door that they can just walk through. I guess if we had a few doors, maybe we have like an airlock, you know, where you have one door leading to another door. I thought I could hear footsteps then, and it sounded louder than a rabbit. Okay, I think we're good. Okay, so if I take this back... We're nearly done now. How many logs have we got on this? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11... You fit 12 on each one, so... Once we've uh, loaded this off, we'll need like one more and then we're nearly done. 
it's good to have a wall around our base now. I know we've got that doorway there, but we have traps there, so cannibals shouldn't be too much of a problem. Because first, they get, uh, they get hung up, so we get at least two from just them being hung. And then, um... Let's, let's try it. I doubt we can. I bet he just drops it. He dropped it, didn't he? Yeah. Okay. So we're doing pretty well. Let's just have a look at if there is anything that we can make. I guess what we could do is have a platform like this, okay, which is a little bit lower, which is about halfway up the wall, okay. And on that, you have holders, log holders, stick holders, rock holders. The main one, though, is just logs, right? And then on the ground, you look up, you put the logs into the holder, you climb up here, you grab the logs out, and then you go into the base. That is a way that we can do it. That is actually a good way that we can do it, I think. So, in fact, we might as well... That sounded a bit weird, didn't it? Uh, in fact, you have to put the log holder... You have to put the log holder on the ground. In fact, what you can do is actually have it halfway through the wall as well. So that's another way you could do it. But I think that's quite unrealistic. And because I want this to be as realistic as possible, we're going to build a platform. You guys are like, oh, for shiz, Danny. Why'd you have to build a platform for? But no, I think it's better if you build a platform. I think it's a little bit more realistic. Okay, so we're going to put that like that. That is if you can put weapon racks on the platform. Surely you can. Actually, I don't like that weapon rack. Uh, th that platform. It was kind of halfway through the wall. And I don't want that. So, okay, let's... We need 15 logs. So... And we're going to need more for that platform. And I think we should try and get the katana pretty soon. And I'm also wondering if maybe we should create a secondary base somewhere deep in the woods where there's just loads of trees around us. So we can just create whatever we like really easily. I'm thinking maybe that would be a better bet, actually. The problem is, if you get overrun and they start destroying stuff, you're kind of screwed because you've got nowhere to go. However, we would be lucky because we've got a secondary base up here which we could run to. In fact, I think that's what we're going to do. Because I'm tired of getting um, logs and dragging them halfway across the map. We are going to... I might be able to find a mod, actually, which grows trees quicker, you know. I might be able to. I don't want to get that tree because it's too near the edge. But this one should be okay. Okay, what we're going to do is... We're going to complete that wall. And then we're going to make up... There's a lizard over there. I can see it. I can see it. I can see it, guys. I can see that lizard. We're going to make our way into towards the katana area and we're going to build a base, okay? 
It's going to be a dangerous location because there's more cannibals over on that side of the island. But where did that lizard go? Probably like disappeared because it walked away. Out of shot. So tomorrow we'll build a secondary base in the woods because there'll be so many freaking trees we can just create whatever we like really easily. Like it's going to be amazing. Because look, we're like running out of trees so badly right now. If I can eventually find a mod where trees grow, then I'll probably come back to this base. But I think for the purposes of progression, I think it will be good to... I'm just going to have some of those because we can always head back to that camp where those cannibals were and just get, get some more. Here it is. Okay, so... We've nearly fit. In fact, I feel like going and setting up a camp now. I know it's dangerous because it's nearly night time. But I think it'd be worth it. But, I mean, look down there. Look how many trees there are, okay? Now, admittedly, by the time you've built a wall and, like, a camp and stuff, most of the forage, like, forest around you will vanish anyway. But this is ridiculous. Like, we've gotten... This area didn't have that many trees in the first place anyway. It had a few, but it wasn't, like, the most... Is dense the right word? And we've always got this to come back to, you know. Hopefully we come back to it and there's it's not destroyed or some something crazy like that. That would suck. Okay, so we need four more. Man, it's so good to actually have a walled off zone though. We have to finish this. We have to finish this. Like this this section of the wall. And then we're going to head in that direction towards the katana. Okay, so that's one. We need three more. I think we chopped down a few, didn't we? And we left them. Ah, here we go. Well, there's one. You see what I mean? Like, if I want to build anything, okay, we're, we're just building a wall. There's so much more we can build. Like, defenses and stuff like that. It's gonna, it's, it would take us for freaking ages to do that. And on the um, forest map, actually shows you some good locations to build. Uh, one of them is like really safe. I think I showed it to you um, a few episodes ago. It's like way up on this cliff, like in the middle of nowhere. But then if you want wood, you've got to travel for ages to get it, you know. Um, and that's why I never picked that location. Like it's very safe. Occasionally you do get stuff coming up to it to scout, but it's very safe, but it's like in the middle of nowhere. It's far away from the woods. So I'm thinking we build a we build a base right in the woods. I could have picked that up actually. It was like some herbs and shears. I 
Right. Okay. We have got enough logs to finish our wall. We can finish the wall, sleep, and then we're going to make our way to the katana area. Now, I don't have full armor, so we're not going to go for it straight away, but we're going to build a base. It might be a temporary one for the start, just like a small little campfire, maybe a treehouse, because I think the treehouses are really good, like, um, build. Okay, nice. We finished it. Man, you imagine if I just climbed up here and there was just like a spider monster or something in my base. I wonder why it's got this out and not the torch. Seems a bit weird. Okay, let's sleep. And in the morning, it's time to shine. 